Okay guys, one of the super common reasons that the average American gives for exercising, quote unquote exercising, is that they're burning more calories and it's helping them to offset or burn off some high calorie days or some high calorie meals and so on. And so that brings up the question of should I use my strength workout as a behavior to help offset some high calorie meals, a high calorie snack, something maybe that I wasn't planning on eating. And the short answer on this is that's not a good idea. When you look at strength training, it's best to be viewing it as a health habit that gives you long-term benefits over time. If you're doing a, again, an evidence-based strength workout, it should be brief. So you're not burning a ton of calories in the workout itself where strength training really shines from a calorie standpoint is the increases in muscle tissue that you achieve over time. So we know we can raise metabolic rate, we can increase the calories that your body needs day to day, but those numbers aren't huge on any given day and on any given moment. So if you said, hey, I had a high calorie meal or breakfast or day, I'm gonna go burn it off in my strength workout. That's a fairly inefficient way to look at the value or reason why you would strength train. Strength training has, of course, dozens of health benefits to it, and it will burn calories, but the big picture is that if you're strength training, you don't lose muscle, you gain it. Over time, metabolic rate is higher. Over time, you're less likely to gain body fat because you're not losing muscle. So. Strength training is a long-term calorie balancing tool if you want to look at it that way, but I wouldn't suggest that you use it to offset the calories that you might have eaten at a high calorie breakfast like donuts and coffee on the run. This is day 306 of Train Like a Champion.